Emory doctors, along with Vital Software, have developed a web-based tool that will make it easier for the general public to determine if they need to go in for a medical visit or stay home during the COVID-19 outbreak. And unless we help to flatten the curve, have people understand how best to access health care services based on their signs and symptoms, um, then some parts of this health system could be pushed to a breaking point, and that's what we want to avoid. Users can link to the tool called SORT for Strategy for Offsite Rapid Triage by going to c19check.com. At the end of the day, if the coronavirus doesn't stand to make a person very sick, the best thing for them to do is stay in their home. And if they don't have the coronavirus, we sure don't want them in the ER being exposed to other people that might have it. Dr. Justin Schrager is an Emory so Emergency kind of Department physician and co-founder of Vital Software, which provides technology designed to help manage patient flow for hospital emergency rooms, which were often already overcrowded even before the COVID-19 pandemic. Vital Software is hosting the new site, which is free to the public. I'm seeing it in the ER. I see people come in concerned that they have coronavirus, and then we find out that they have influenza or they have a common cold, both much more common than coronavirus. Everyone's had the experience of waiting too long in a busy emergency department. That is just going to be amplified now in the context of a COVID-19 pandemic. The site, designed at Emory's Health Design Ed Center, is using the best evidence available to help guide people on what next steps to take once they've shown symptoms consistent with the novel coronavirus. So if we can keep one more patient out of the hospital that doesn't need to be there, that's supplies that we can use on one patient that does. Doctors like Schrager are already feeling the impact of the pandemic. He has had to isolate himself from his family and is now living in a garage apartment separate from his main house. And the reason I'm out here is because I don't want to expose my family to coronavirus. I don't think I have it. I certainly don't have symptoms, but, but I have a three week old yeah. and um, not seeing her. So mm -hmm. I'm doing everything I can with this website to um, make this outbreak end. <laughs> so if I could do that by building this website, giving it out to everybody in the country for free and get the message out that, you know, stay home, it's okay for you to stay home, mm -hmm. then that's going to shorten the amount of time that I'm going to be living in my garage until it's over with.